your girl. Sorry, forgot girl. You think I gave a fool? Well, clearly I don't. Oh, hater, 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 watch your mouth. That is dangerous. Hater, 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 what's the blood? Don't play God. God. Haters, 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 that behave like alligators. Haters, 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 that behave like alligators. Haters, 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 that behave like alligators. Haters, 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 that behave like alligators. guys so you just saw uh, my 4th of July lift as you can tell by the attire got a very USA theme going on um, so we had deadlifts today it's our second to last heavy deadlift day before the meet we're staying at just under four weeks out at this point so um, this week we kind of took a step back we only did 395 kilos 870 pounds moved pretty well um, would have liked it to move a little bit better but to be honest I went to a music festival on Saturday and um, Stayed sober and everything, but still just <laughs> a lot of dancing and stuff, and um, my back's pretty wrecked from that. But um, anyways, uh, I mean, it moved It moved well. It moved okay. I would have liked it a little bit quicker, but I didn't use any ammonia. I wasn't really, um, came in there with the, the hype. It was a different training time than I'm used to, so um, a lot of factors. But otherwise, it's, it's moving well. It's moving in the right direction. It's still 870 pounds, so it's not <laughs> nothing I can complain about. Um, next week, try and, try and go for like 9.03, maybe 9.09 or whatever, like two and a half kilo PR, but we'll see what's on the table. Um, so we got, yeah, one more heavy deadlift day, and then we have two more heavy squat and bench days. Um, squat has been going very well, hit 771 this weekend, 350 kilos, uh, moved great, ties a PR actually, and, um, I'm really excited about how it's going. Uh, a lot of it probably has to do with the new the new knee sleeves from Iron Rebel. Those will be coming out next few months. I don't know when, but uh, yeah, they uh, they are very tight. It's it's I'm a little bit nervous for me day because they're they're so tight that it's uh, uncomfortable to have them on. And like I I lift pretty quick, so <laughs> we'll see how like keeping them on for you know last. Two or three warm ups plus three attempts that are gonna be like 15 minutes apart or so. So we'll see how that goes. I might have to pull them down in between attempts or something, but I don't I don't think it'll be too big of an issue. Um, bench has been not the best this prep, but to be honest, uh, I mean I'm still hitting 550. My goal is like 584 in the meet. I hit 550 this weekend. Moved pretty decent. Um, I kind of. 
one end of the workout with the idea like, all right, I'll hit 550 if it really flies and I'll send it at 584 just to kind of get back on track. But uh, it moved well, but not enough to be for me to feel confident to go to the 584. Then plus I didn't have Andy to give me my handoffs. I just had uh, um, Josh, another gym member. It was a it was a fine handoff, but it's just not what I'm used to. And um, at that kind of weight, I definitely want to be familiar with the person handing it off to me. But um, other than that, honestly, I'm not super focused on this meet, the American Pro, and was it three and a half weeks at this point. Uh, I'm more so really focused on the USPA Pro in 12 weeks. Um, just the reasoning behind that is it's kind of hard to focus on like two meets so close together so you kind of have to pick which one you want to really set your sights on and that one is the one I'm choosing just because um, as you see it kind of moved in. I'm all done moving into the new place for the most part. Um, unfortunately though this is just a temporary situation. I'm moving from uh, just into a condo for about two weeks and then I'll move in with Andy just as a, a layover so we can get kind of situated and having two moves within a month of a beat is very difficult to deal with so um, with that I'm just I'm not going into it expecting too much I'd like to get maybe like some small PRs on each lift but you know we'll see on bench I'm pretty confident with squat but yeah anything could change on meet day in the last four weeks or so but yeah we'll see how it goes um, other than that what, oh, we have the um, we're running a um, promotion this week uh, this week um, from well now until June 10th on the proven strength app it's 50% off for July 4th weekend um, use code 50 and you get 50% off your first month so it's normally twenty nine ninety nine a month. It goes down to fourteen ninety nine, and see so that for the first month is they sign up using that code. Then the second month it goes back up to the normal price. Um, you get access to all nineteen programs right off the bat. You can pick and choose which one you want to do. Um, take a look at them, see which one kind of suits your best. It goes from beginner, intermediate, advanced. You also have uh, three, four, five day programs, um, off season and peaking. Also, the uh, power building block that we just released and have heard pretty good things about so far. So, um, yeah, with that, uh, we'll catch you in the next one, and don't suck.